pretty sure this is going to land me into the uh, old fart category. We got a little frost and I harvested my sweet potatoes. And so I had to connect the little dump wheelbarrow to the back of the lawn tractor so that I could carry the sweet potatoes where they need to go to get the skins cured on them. I've never, uh, I've never grown sweet potatoes before. These are white sweet potatoes. I bought them at the, some at the local Walmart a while back, and as Walmart tends to do, they quit carrying them. And uh, I can't stand the yellow ones, or the red ones, or orange, or whatever they are. And so I decided to grow my own. So I bought a dozen slips from... Wow, I can't remember the name of the company. They grow them in Virginia. And uh, 12 slips. One of them died right away. I harvested one about a month ago, but this is the other 10. And a couple of moles and critters got in and started eating some of them. But uh, I got a decent batch, I suppose. Some of them were gigantic like this. I mean, that's a that's a pretty dang good sized sweet potato. And then there's little, little bitty ones like this, which I've never, I don't know if, uh, if they should be fine, I don't know. Got weird looking long ones like that. I'll uh, let the skins dry up on them and cure a while and uh, store them and hopefully they'll keep long enough so I can eat them. I did record a video earlier this year uh, using the, the gravely with the rotary plow to um, create the hill to grow these and uh, that's what remains of it right there. I had a melon plant growing at the far end. But the sweet potatoes all grew right here. They seem to do okay. A lot of long vines and they got nipped by the frost. I covered the pepper plants a couple of nights ago when it frosted and they they mostly made it through okay. Some of the leaves on the top got nipped a little bit. But uh, there's still peppers growing down in there. I like to pick them when they're red. We got bell peppers and then the Anaheim peppers. They're mostly done, but I I didn't want to let them completely go if there were still going to be some good ones on the vines.